What's up guys here at the 2019 Syndicate HO Collegiate Water Ski Nationals. Hanging out with some of my Iowa State friends. Hey. Oh, sorry, I said Iowa State. Oh, it is shit. What's up everybody? 2019 Collegiate Water Ski Nationals sponsor spawn. Marcus Brown here at the 2019 Syndicate Syndicate at the 2019 Syndicate Water Ski Nationals. 2019 Syndicate Collegiate Water Ski Nationals. My camera just All right, how about we try something a little different? Let's start with a simple question. Have you seen this before? Do you think you know what this feels like? Oh yeah, I know some of you probably do. Some of you are lucky enough to have had the chance to be a part of this life on the water. But for the rest of you, maybe you should stick around. Class is just getting started, and we're going to give you a little taste of what collegiate water skiing hey. is all about. It's the sea. <laughs> Woo. Once again, here we go. Know the name, know the flow. Turn me up a little more. I'm setting traps, I'm alone. You know you whack, I'm a maniac. Boy, you know I'm black to the bone. Pick a place, nigga, pick a date. I go go cool, pick a low. Thought you was good, huh? Take you out back, drag you through the woods, huh? Thought I was weak, huh? You ain't see the work I put in all week, huh? Give me that, where the city at? Nitty gritty, this ain't gonna be pretty, Jack. Not afraid, get up out the way. Y'all used to hate, look at what you made. When it all goes down, I'ma run this town. Fire in my soul, got my eyes on the ground. I can't help myself lately, can't turn myself down. I'm in love with you, baby, but I let you down. I can't die in this town, I won't die in this town. Yeah. Hey. Don't die in this town. Hold up, homie, let's wait a minute Lately, y'all ain't even pay no visits I can still hear the hated critics Saying he ain't gon' make it, is he? Lately, I developed laser vision Yeah, I burn through people in their cruel intentions Crazy, you tryna play me? Boy, you wouldn't even make the scrimmage Get your ass up and pass up your limits Got these new rappers looking vintage All I really do is eat spinach Count money up and hang with pretty women I was driven, yeah, I had the vision Then goon came along and made a vivid Haters living cause we really living I'm a freight train, you a Honda Civic Hold up, wait, let me get specific If you pick a mission and you stay committed Stop transmitting and you really listen You'll see that big collision, just a big transition When it all goes down I'm gonna run this town I in my soul, got my eyes on the ground I can't help myself, really can't turn myself down I'm in love with you, baby, but I let you down I can't die in this town, I won't die in this town Hey guys, Marcus Brown here at the 2019 Syndicate Collegiate Water Ski Nationals. I'm here with some of my friends from Iowa State. Yeah. We already got a PB right here in yeah, men's baby. jump, over 80 feet. We've got D1 women's slalom. We've got ultimate frisbee. We've got all the water toys. We've got all the vibes. This is the premier event in water skiing as far as I'm concerned, and I've been to every one of them. And over the next three days, we're gonna talk to some people who have had their lives literally changed for the better through this sport. And uh, we're gonna dig into the why. Why are people still in the sport three or four decades later? Why are new people coming in every year? Why are people finding that this community is one of the coolest communities that you can become a part of? And it's one of the easiest ways to get into water skiing. Collegiate skiing makes it happen. And uh, we're gonna find out why. 
I've been jumping for five years, so I started my freshman year. I got on the two skis for my first time ever. Oh, it is the reason I have friends pretty much. Like, I go out skiing 6 a.m., I go out skiing till 7 p.m., like the sun goes down. I love nationals, like it's my favorite holiday of the year. So my PV right now is 73 feet. I would be stoked with anything higher than that. I will say I've got a really close friend who's jumping 80 feet and she's been jumping awesome. So I feel like if I <laughs> did something really, really stupid, I could beat her. <laughs> it was awesome. I felt like I freaking flew. 79. And my PB at the beginning of the year for the past year and a half was 69. Without them, I wouldn't have done like putting the letter up three. Without them, I wouldn't have like partied on the dock and gotten in the good mindset. Like, I was so nervous I was gonna puke, and by the time I got on the dock, I was awesome. I feel like I slipped up a little bit and feel like a little bit more, but I mean, look at it here, you can't really complain. It's Two is, I felt good at two, and then three, and came a little short at four, and just had a little too much panic, and had some other thoughts in my head, and lost the focus. I went 92 on a single, kind of on cloud nine. I walked into it unexpectedly, and it's the best thing that ever happened to me. I met my best friends, and found just like a new passion. It's driven me through college, and so fortunate. We get to play around on water all day. People are in classrooms right now. Like, look at our view. And it's excused. Check this girl out. She is doing something most people have never done. Yeah. Sit ski. Yeah. Yeah. So tell me what's going to happen out there today. Hopefully I'm going to break the record. National record. 53 feet. So what's your best? 50. 50 feet. Sitting. On that thing, <laughs> going off a five foot ramp. Are you crazy? Maybe. <laughs>great Jamie Ball. Oh, really? Yeah, they came up to our tent and they're oh. like, where's that girl that ran five and a half at 39? And I said, she's over playing basketball. What about Big Griff? Everybody big Griff? Wants big Griff Nobody dude. wants to meet Big Griff. Come on, dude. No. It's all good. Jacob Murphy, junior from Michigan State University. Uh, what, what just happened out there? Ran my 28 good, a little scrappy, but you know, I got through it and then uh, come around, come around two ball. Uh, I'm 30, got pulled up the front. Yeah. Nice hard fall. Oh, it, was hard fall. it was, yeah. Dude, tell, tell me about collegiate skiing. Yeah, so got a school email that got sent to everyone in the university. Water ski team's having a meeting tonight. Come check us out. I was like, all right, I'll see what it's, see what it's like. Yeah. Went to the first meeting, went to the next meeting, been hooked ever since. Definitely just taught me how to achieve my goals, grow as a person, and uh, be around the best people. My last national jump tournament ever. Yeah. Last national, so I got to boot one big. Do it for the team. Yeah, I think I had the same O'Neill jumpsuit. Yeah. Like 92. Probably, yeah. Probably was yours. NCWSA Nationals. Why? Because we're college skiers. And it's so cool to compete with my brother. And best friends like this who I've been skiing with since I was like, the, uh, girls too? Five years old. I'd say it's my favorite tournament by far. What about you? Yeah. What's the question? <laughs> First one just easy, one for the team. Yeah. Get that get that score on the on the board. Second one just felt good, like had a lot of speed. Came around the turn, perfect spot, low laid, perfect. Kicked it. Thought the boat off the ramp, just got pulled in here. I was like, that's it. Yeah, you go down, you see all the people, the team on the shore. You're like, that's, that's amazing. Like, you can't compare to any tournament. Like, I've been to Walls everywhere, but this is different. Like, you have your team behind it, everybody supports you, and it's just perfect. Good job, dude. Thanks. Thanks. 
date felt good. I was like nice and slow and calm into one. Felt super good. Two was all right. Three, last weekend, safety three. That was not safety and three this time. <laughs> I went for it and I hooked up really well. Into four, I kind of been falling at four in practice a lot. So I was like, I'm not gonna try and kill four ball. Just tried to rotate through the turn. And I came into five and I knew I was in a position to turn it. And I was still calm, still wasn't freaking out. I turned five and as I hooked up at five, I was like, I need to get going. I'm gonna get outside six. And I just like dropped the shoulder to get outside six and got around six and I thought it was okay. And then my ski just slipped out. I got an awkward balance point out and lost the handle. Like I came out and people were loud and people were cheering. My team was hyped. And there was a lot of feeling in that moment. We don't really have that. Like if I had run five and a half in a pro tournament right now, people would be psyched, but it would be a small inner group of people that, you know, have worked with me or who are like paying attention to my skiing. Not this entire community or family kind of. You don't step off the dock for yourself. You step off the dock for 20 other people that are on the shore. And I think that's very different as well. You don't have that feeling any other time than in collegiate skiing. And I think it puts an added pressure, but it also motivates a lot of people. So it's pretty special. Yeah, yeah.